my name is Malcolm Thompson. I'm a photographer. I am now 65 years old and been making photographs since I was 11. Spent my life working as a commercial photographer. The exhibition is called Seeing the Wood and the Trees. A nice play on by my colleague Alan. He thought up that one. I'm Alan Beveridge and uh, I'm a printmaker and painter and uh, I have a studio at Meadow Mill in Dundee and I also work at Dundee Print Workshop. Well it really started years ago when we were both working at the print studio and um, just sitting talking and we realised that we'd been doing similar sorts of things and uh, we, we gradually had enough work for an exhibition at the Meffin in Forfar. We both have a reputation, quote, <laughs> in the art world. We didn't have to show them any work, we, just, we, we gave them the idea verbally and they said go for it and they trusted us to come up with the work. And the exhibition we have today is uh, sort of widening it out a bit so we've uh, been exploring woodland in Fife um, and gradually built up a collection of work from Tents Muir, Balburnie, uh, Morton Lochs, Loch Ore Meadows. What I like about trees is how they look. It might sound bizarre but I'm not, I don't need to know what type of tree they are, though I have favourites like everybody. I love the way the trees just had a mind of their own and took off and went in different directions. That's what I like about them. I'm, I'm, not, I'm not interested in the botanical element of them. I think it was George Brack said that um, painting from, from nature is uh, to improvise. So when you're out painting for two or three hours, obviously in this country the light's going to change quite a lot in that time. So you really have to improvise. So over sort of two or three hours, you can end up with a, a picture which is quite different from what you're going to thought you were going to end up with at the beginning. I'm attempting to read Alan's mind here. Not everything that he paints and draws in situ is a finished piece of work. Whereas with my photography, once I've made that exposure, that's it. All I have to do then is make a print the size that I want to make. So m my work is finished almost before it started. <laughs> the exhibition, which has just opened at the Loch Gelly Centre, runs until the 2nd of April. <laughs>